I'm a little concerned about this next thing I have up. Um, Dogfish Head from up in uh, Delaware. Delaware? Delaware. Dogfish Head from up in Delaware has a beer that they call, and I know I'm going to fuck up the name on this, Raison de Etat? Edit? It's a Belgian brown style beer brewed with raisins. What I, that's not what I have. What I have is Raison de Extra. And this is, it says on the front, brewed with an obscene amount of malt, brown sugar, and raisins. Why would they make a claim like that on the front of the bottle? What makes me so concerned about this? Well, in the brewing of beer, uh, when you add yeast to it, it starts eating the sugars from the malts and anything else you add, like brown sugar and raisins, and that's what produces or produces some or most of the alcohol in beer. So if you have a beer that's brewed with an obscene amount of malts, raisins, and brown sugar, you got something that's going to have a lot of alcohol in it. And um, I didn't see an alcohol on here anywhere. I didn't see the ABV on here. I had to look it up. It averages somewhere between 15 and 18%. So I'm a little concerned about what I'm going to get here. I'm sure it's going to be delicious. I have no fear that this is going to be awesome. Um, it's just one of those times where this is going to be my beer for the evening. You know, I might have a few other things that I want to try, but this is, this is going to be it. Um, so I, I poured it out and it's got a very, it had a very small head on it. And I've noticed a lot of times higher ABVs, higher alcoholic beers will have less head on it. It'll seem less flat, but that's just because of the higher alcohol. Supposedly Sam Adams has their $200 beer, which is like I think almost 40% and it like there's no carbonation in it. There's no foam or head on it. So it smells, I mean, it smells a little like, you know, a bourbon, but like a raisin bread bourbon. And it is, it is very sweet. And you don't really, there is a little bit of the alcoholic taste in there, but it is, it is buried under those malt and raisin flavors. And I'm trying to take very small tentative tip, sips of that. Um, and when I was looking this up on the website, they did say this was kind of like the, the, the wine, a little bit like a wine of their beers. The ABV is very similar, 15, 18%. Um, and the look and the kind of style of it, it's, it's got kind of a darker red hue to it. So they said that's the kind of thing to eat with a really nice steak. And um, I'm going to need something to kind of soak up this, this alcohol. So I made a stop uh, south of the border. So hopefully, hopefully these will help me out. Mm. Chicken enchilada burritos. Very good. Hopefully, these will still be out when I put out this video. Otherwise, I'm going to kind of look like a jerk. <laughs>